Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Let's Play City Skylines and Modded Series. This is the River on Map, and we're playing on Ezidy City. This is episode 38. I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, sorry it took so long to figure out an actual way of filming that you guys liked. So the other episode uh, had some positive feedback on, so I'm thinking of sticking with it for until uh, until someone says otherwise but uh i don't know when i was watching the video it kind of feel, felt a little weird uh just hearing my voice in the ambient noises going around especially with the time lapses it uh found a way to retain some of the audio pitch and whatnot but it was a little bit weird but anyway uh, i continue to give me your feedback uh, i really like uh, your input on the things that we decide for this uh, particular channel. Anyway, uh, let's go over what we did last time. What we did was uh, actually fix up this area. We zoned the last bottom parts of the tiles. So what we're going to do today is open up the third tile, reconnect the rail roads, and maybe uh, check out what services that we need. Without further ado and without further delay, let's begin. Check click it. Before we purchased another towel, I wanted to fix up the bus line, so I redid the bus line, uh, made sure that it covered on the bottom half. I also had to delete some of the other bus line. Well, it was mostly a mistake, <laughs> but I redid it and I, it should be optimized to have good coverage and not have such a long uh, route for the citizens to get to. That should be more efficient. I wanted to make sure that all the services were evenly distributed. I was looking for anything that needed green and checked those out. Uh, deleted extra uh, crematoriums. There's anything that had pairs I removed. And I made sure that uh, we had adequate fire coverage. And I we were at around 20%. So I didn't want to have a lot of fires. There's a bunch of orange here. so. It's easily to easily easily fixed. All we have to do is add a firehouse. Thank you. 
All right, take a candor at this area. This is a full lush green area. We're about to deforest it so that we could see better, but mostly it's a game mechanic to uh, deforest this area. Uh, each tree is an asset and it adds to the, my processing power. So by deleting it, it uh, frees up that uh, the process power and removes an asset, uh, even if you build a road on top of it. This might sound a little weird, but here we go. I always wanted to add more uh, leisure buildings, so particular buildings add up or make uh, are part of a goal or a milestone to create something that's uh, that's an unlockable building, which uh, or uh, yeah, unlockable building. So that particular one, the Helicron, uh, helps unlock the space elevator which i'm not quite sure does if you, if you know uh, you could you could share it in the comments if you want what i might have to do with population but i'm not quite sure it's pretty cool it's uh, the tallest building in that area so it's out of kind of out of place but it's right next to the high school <laughs> that's the only plus that i could think of yeah so we're, we're slowly positioning uh, different leisure buildings, uh, increasing the land value of our areas. I think this is the Statue of Wealth. Oh no, this is something else. Can't really see while I'm editing. Uh, everything is one fourth the size, so I'll probably uh, put something in the comments what this is.
wanted to improve on this particular industrial area. This is part of the industry's DLC. There are trees or uh, medium uh, tree plantations, I think, that I could upgrade. Didn't really notice uh, because I was uh, building the other side of the map. So I uh, decided to upgrade more of this stuff while, uh, while we think about uh, what we want to do as far as the third tile goes. We want to optimize the top two tiles before we uh, head down there. And uh, I don't know, I, I added barracks too, but it seems like it, it shied, it made uh, most of the workers shy away. So I kept getting lower numbers. I'm not sure what I was doing wrong. If you have any idea how to improve the, uh, or increase the amount of workers here, uh, feel free to leave me a comment. The patch of uh, the second tile that we didn't we didn't zone, so I decided to uh, finish it up before we did the third tile. I don't think we're gonna get to the third tile in this episode. I was gonna think about it uh, offline. I had a plan for uh, the campus area, maybe an industrial sector, but commercial seems to be in high demand, so the most likely concentrate on something like that. Maybe the middle island will have some sort of after dark uh, commerce area. We'll see. We got our recycling center. I noticed there was a, uh, I guess there is a lack of uh, sanitation in this part of the map. So I tried to add something to help out at a recycling center. I use the recycling center instead of the incineration plant because I think the incineration plant has more pollution and the recycling center seems to be a lot more suited or near an industrial sector because its materials can be used to or 
the garbage can be broken down to create more material. I'm really glad I got the train working. Now we got we got a what a, a passenger uh, path. I'll probably make that a one of the main ways to get from the, the southern end of the map to the top. And it looks like we got some oil here too. So so far we have a plan in my head. I might share. I'll probably share it on my Facebook. But uh, yeah, we'll see. Should be interesting. Well, I'm still scratching my head about this thing. Uh, but this is all the time that we have. Uh, we're approached the hour. I'd like to thank everybody for watching. Uh, if you liked what you see, please consider subscribing to the channel. Like, follow, comment, subscribe, ding that bell, and I'll see you in three days. I'm active on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and now Reddit. Be sure to follow those. And uh, as always, if you want to uh, contribute to the channel, uh, leave me a comment below. I read all comments. I also read all messages. Uh, a lot of people prefer to send me uh, those DMs and uh, let me know what's up about the game. Uh, not everyone uses uh, YouTube surprisingly, but uh, I would really like if we can uh, reach that goal of the 100. It's one of the milestones that I've been looking forward to. It allows me to change my username which is Mazadan and doesn't match my name that I've been saying. Mazadan, but anyway, uh, this is Mazadan signing out. Take care. I'll see you in three days. And uh, please remember, you are essential.